What's up guys? This is correct. Welcome back to a brand new video in this video. I'm going to show you guys on how to learn programming for absolutely free. Now before we start this video there are some things you guys should know about this. First and foremost you don't need any experience or knowledge to learn programming whatsoever so you can be a complete novice and not know any sort of code or anything about computers. That doesn't matter in this case. You guys can learn for free and easily. The second thing is you don't need to pay a single cent for this and it will always be free. There are those services where you sit down on a computer and you're learning something and then you notice like a week later the trial ended and then you have to pay. That's not going to happen again. This is completely free. So you don't have to worry about that. So with that being said why should you learn to code or to program? It's simple. When you guys want programming you can become a web developer and later on a full stock developer so you could be sitting at home on a computer drinking your coffee learning code and in a couple months later you go on your online web and you go to freelancing sites and like upwork.com and then you start making money and you help people out and you get paid for working at home. I know countless of people my age and younger than me they're 16 making hundreds and even thousands of dollars a month. So it's all worth it. How do you get started? I'm going to show you guys that right now it's a free website that you guys can see down in the description link below called freecodecamp.org. Now I want to go ahead. Sure you guys this but real quick just so you guys know as a disclaimer I do not own the site and I am not affiliated with the site I personally use this website to learn code myself which is why I'm spreading the word and spreading the large to you guys. So with that being said let's begin. Okay. So we're here at freecodecamp.org now to start. It's simple. All you guys gotta do is click the orange start coding button right here. And from there you guys I'm going to continue the Google or with Facebook or with email doesn't matter. I'm going to go ahead and just for this example put in a temp email just to show you guys you can do the same thing. Put an email address email and then put the code in that you get from the email and then click submit code and continue to free code camp and from there all you guys will do is click on the go to coding curriculum. Once you guys are on a coding curriculum you're going to get three sections of the screen the guide section. The editor section on the center and the live production section on the right side of the screen. So following left side of the screen you is an English tutorial and then you're going to get a little challenge. You guys are gonna have to pass the challenge. So in this case I'm going to go ahead and have to do an H1 element and type in hello world. That's where it's asking to do run the test. You can see we did it and then we go to the next challenge. The next challenge again you just gotta follow the instructions. This time we have to do an H2 element and do a capital lab test. So do that. And you guys get the idea. Basically what you guys want to do is make sure you follow the instructions carefully. I highly recommend you guys get a notebook and take notes along the way. It does get very easy. It is very easy to start with but it will get more and more challenging. And if you guys are getting stuck while doing this you don't have to worry. You can click on get a hint and I'll give you guys a hint on what to do or if you're absolutely stuck and you want to see how you can do it how you can pass it then you can watch your video and he will tell you exactly what you did wrong and show you the right way. And that's pretty much it. So in conclusion we learned that there is a program you guys can use and it does look simple at first but it progresses and gets more difficult. So you guys are responsible for sitting through the lessons and trying to check off each of the lessons you guys learned beginning with HTML and then CSX visual design and eventually JavaScript. There's hundreds and hundreds of countless of hours of free learning you guys can get with this. You're going to be sitting there and thinking about the challenge you're going to be like wow this is very difficult. How do I move on to the next challenge? So you really have to test yourself and take notes as I mentioned. I will really help you out but at the end of the day it was all worth it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope I helped you guys out. 
if you have any comments or suggestions on what videos you guys normally to do next. Go ahead and comment them below. And with that be